What's up guys so in this video I'm gonna show you how you can uh, fix this error so many of you are facing this error like a refresh when you're trying to refresh your PC uh, there will be a problem like it will be occur like there was a problem refreshing your PC and no changes were made and all that so on this video I'm gonna show you how you can easily fix this easiest way you don't have to do anything like run command and anything so it will be the easiest way to do this so uh, without wasting any more time let's get started so first thing first i'm gonna show you like uh, whenever you try to reset your pc or um, basically refresh your pc uh, if you are getting this error so if you are getting this error like could not find the recovery environment and all that or uh, like your windows installation or recovery media will provide this file and all that so for that error i already had made video on this so uh, you can get that video on the i button so you can check out from over there as well and uh, for uh, now i'm going to show you how you can fix this error while after that step if you are facing this error like refreshing your pc or no changes were made then how you can fix this so what you need is you need a iso file basically so if you are uh, doing this thing over here you already downloaded that ISO file but so in case if you haven't downloaded that uh, ISO file yet then you can just go to get into PC go just go to this website and you have to go through operating system you will find the ISO file over here Windows 10 Windows uh, 7 8 and everything you can find uh, whatever Windows you are using you can just download it from over here now the one thing that I have to uh, I would like to tell you that uh, right now I'm using Windows 8 but the method will be work on the Windows 10 as well so you don't worry about that it will be also work on Windows 10 so just to the, follow the all step carefully and it will be work on your Windows 10 as well if you are running on Windows 10 so uh, next what you have to do is you have to download one software called WinCDEMU basically so the so you just have to download this software and uh, uh, it's just one MBA software so you just download it now click on install over here so as I already downloaded and installed it on this PC so I'm not going to install it again so I'm just closing this now uh, after so after downloading and uh, doing everything you just have to do is uh, just browse that file and just right click on it on the ISO file basically now click on open file uh, open with win CDEMU and now there will be option like uh, keep uh, drive after restart so you just have to select this option and click on ok now uh, after that you have to go to this PC and just uh, and just go ahead and you will find uh, this uh, CD drive basically basically it's not a CD drive it's just a mounted file of the win, uh, of the ISO file so just right click on it click on open now you have to click on this setup file so just double click on it and just click on yes now it will be load uh, your windows installation file so just wait for a few seconds so as I already told you that I am using Windows 8.1 so uh, the file uh, for the matter is also same for Windows 10 so if you are using Windows 10 it will be work over there as well so don't worry about that just open up uh, this file and follow all the instructions carefully it will be work over there as well. So once you are over here you have to click on no thanks and just click on next option it will be check your PC and check your all the specification and all that so just wait for a few seconds it will be load for you. So as you can see there is some licenses agreement so you just have to accept it and just click on next button now the main thing is you have to uh, wait here and uh, do the care things carefully so as you are refreshing your pc so you have to click on this keep personal file only so it will be just keep your personal file and, uh, and just reset your windows and the apps and uh, all that will be removed but your personal file will be kept so uh, on the refreshing side you have to select this option and you have to click on next so as you can see it shows that ready to install so on this case you just have to click on next button and make sure you have selected keep personal file only and your windows uh, 8.1 or 10 whatever you have over here so just click on next and uh, as of now i'm not showing everything uh, like uh, it will be now next it will be installed windows on your pc and uh, remove other things and just keep your personal file so it will be work like the refreshing your pc and if you're facing that error like uh, no changes were made and all that so the error will no longer be occur on 
on this method so it is the easiest way and you can do it on your own so uh, because uh, I uh, because of the quick tutorial I'm not going to show everything like installation process and all that it will be just easy and just click on next and it will be start the installing process on the on your Windows computer so for more such awesome tutorial and yeah I'll see you guys in the next one until then always keep smiling